Hi, how many times per day are you taking screenshots? In my case, it's quite a lot. I think on average, I would take 10 per day. And not just for copying and pasting into a presentation or an email, but also because you want to explain something to a support or help desk to, to let them see what you are seeing. And if something goes wrong, you would like to show them, okay, this is what I'm seeing. This is the part that goes wrong. Maybe you also would like to add some text to it or arrows or stuff to uh, well make it more clear what you are talking about. My name is Olaf and today I'm going to guide you through this tool called Lightshot, which is a very easy lightweight tool for Windows and Mac. And as they say it themselves, it's the fastest way to take customizable screenshots. So why did I need this? Well, once I was in software development, uh, not as a developer myself, but at that time I was leading a group of developers and for a customer that I was responsible for, I was in Chile. And at that time we needed uh, to do a demonstration in a couple of days time. But there were a lot of things well, wrong with the software at that moment. And with wrong, I don't mean basically wrong, but just uh, let's say look and feel and uh, interface and stuff like that. So what I needed at that time was not only some tool you could use to make a print screen, but a tool that you could write on and that you could draw in. So you could easily pinpoint the areas that needed to be fixed. Also, I needed something that I could use to share the print screen to the cloud as some help desk or some other tools or some uh, let's say antivirus systems as well, do not allow you to copy paste images directly. So if so, you need something that you can upload it to and that you can download it from. So that was very easy if that would be the case with the tool that I was looking for. In general, I was copy and pasting images a lot in my past with regards to the sneaker website as well. And if you have some issues with tools or uh, other programs on your uh, laptop or desktop that are not working as they should, you need screenshots for clarification. And if you use those, uh, those screenshots, it would be nice if you could amend them and then add text to them, etc. So what are the benefits of Lightshot? Well, Lightshot works with your regular print screen. You just install it, it's a very lightweight application. And when you do, and you click print screen, then it's on already. I mean, if I do print screen right now, you, you can see what I mean. What is very uh, convenient is that you can change the area after you've selected it. There is also a Windows 10 default print screen application, but after you selected your text, or your uh, screen or the part of the screen that you want, it's not possible to change it anymore. You have to re-select it. So in Lightshot, you can change this area after you selected it. I'll show you, it's like this, but I want to have it a little bit wider. I do it like that. You can share the link on social media, or you could just copy the link to well, paste it in an email or put it on some website or whatever you want. So I could also demonstrate this directly by doing the share. And then you can share it to Twitter, Facebook, Blogger or Pinterest in one go. Editing is very, very convenient then that with Lightshot you can edit your print screen easily. So if I would select it again, and I would say, okay, well, this part boxes is not correct. I could draw a rectangle around it. I could highlight it and I could say, it should be boxes with a capital, for example. And if I want, I could use some other colors to, well, highlight what I'm talking about. I could also pre-format 
things with a pen. I have some lines, so I could say, okay, social media. And as said, if I want this to be purple, our home default color, I could use it like this as well. If I want, I could go for the direct printing option. And I could copy it like this or save it as an image on my computer as well. I will change this back to red now since I use that the most. And I will escape for now. So this works much faster than saving it to your computer and edit it in PowerPoint or with paint or whatever you are using. You can just do it on the fly, on the go with Lightshot. Just print screen and do whatever you want. So you have some, if I, let's say console A would just select the whole screen, as you can see now. And since I'm working on two screens, it is both screens at, at one go. But as said, I can also just change what I have, even like this. So you can always select just what you need. And if I copy it and I would paste it in the presentation, then I could do this. Of course, now I'm in presentation mode, so that doesn't work. But let me go back and show you this is what I just copied. And since Lightshot is for PC and Mac, well, everybody can use it. So what are the use cases? Well, as said, it is very convenient for software development. If you want to explain what you're seeing or what, what you're missing or what your well requested features are, it's, it's really, really easy to uh, edit the image and just write on it and, and describe what you would like to see. Also for developing websites or sales funnels, this can be very handy just to explain what is happening and what you want. Support issues as said, presentations, emails, etc. And um, my tip would be, well, I have two tips actually. My first tip is, I earlier explained the Ditto copy paste tool, right? So if you use Lightshot in combination with Ditto, you can copy your images, give them a name in Ditto, and you can reuse them anytime you like, because they are just in the system. I use Ditto all the time, as you can see, here is the image that I just copied. So those two work fantastically together. And another tip would be, if you use a WordPress website, there is this plugin called The Paste, and with that, you can directly copy paste images into your WordPress system without having to download them first, giving them a name and uploading them again. So with the Lightshot tool, you just say, all right, I need this. I want this part. I copy it with the copy button and I just paste it into WordPress directly. It's a huge time saver. So what are people saying? Well, Lightshot gets a lot of raving reviews um, because, well, it's really easy, it's lightweight, it's fast. But to me, the, the main reasons and the main benefits are that you can edit it on the fly, you can change the size on the fly, and moreover, it has this, and I haven't showed you this yet, it has the, the option to upload it to the cloud. So let's see how, how that works on the next slide. I almost showed you all the features already. So what I just want to add now is I'm going to print my screen. I select the area that I want to upload and I upload it to the cloud. And it's already uploaded directly at this time. And now I will go to the site and as you can see here it is 
directly in the cloud. So this link can be sent to a support department, a help desk or a friend or a colleague or whatever. So if you, for example, are short in uh, disk space or you just don't want to clutter your, your own computer with it, you can use this. But also a lot of uh, tools or, or support systems don't allow you to paste uh, images directly into the system. So for that, you could use this option. So just to recap what you can do with it, you can edit stuff, you could enter some text, you could directly print it if you like, it's also very handy and then you could just choose to print it on one page, just to have it fit on one page. It's very easy for, uh, well, sometimes for, for tickets and stuff. So upload to the cloud, share it to social networks. You can do a reverse search on, on Google, print it, copy it and save it. And here, of course, you can do all the editing stuff. And if you want to undo things, that is easy as well. So I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you in the next video.